in our house this weekend. I had two daughters, two boyfriends, three cats, and two dogs. I'm just sitting here at my desk today doing a little bit of work and I just started thinking about what a great Easter weekend I had. And so I decided I wanted to share it with you. Both of my daughters came home to visit for Easter weekend, which it has been since Thanksgiving, since they were both in the house at the same time. So my oldest daughter, Kendall, and my youngest daughter, Brecken, both came home for the weekend. They brought their boyfriends and we just had a ball. We had had this plan for a couple weeks, so I knew they were gonna come. So every day that they were home for the Easter weekend, I just, we had big things planned. I don't know if you all know this, but I have grandkitties. Not dogs, not babies, but kitties. Both of my girls, Brecken and Kendall, have kitty cats. If you've been on my channel for a while, you have met Kendall's cat, Milo, and you've met Brecken's cat, Mochi, but you have not met Kendall's new little kitty cat, Sasha. So in our house this weekend, I had two daughters, two boyfriends, three cats, and two dogs. <laughs> so there was a lot going on, but we had such a great time. So on Saturday, we got up, Kendall and her boyfriend Tebow and I took the dogs on a walk. We did a lot of chatting and walking. When we got back from our walk, we had fan mail. So here's a little snippet of us opening the fan mail, sitting outside, enjoying the sunshine around the pool with Pollux and Maxie. And of course, the fan mail was for them. Fan mail. We got more fan mail, right guys? We're going to see what's in here. Are you sniffing it? What is it? trees. This fan mail came from California. It says a loyal customer in Laguna Woods, California. Let's see who it from? Pretty flowers. Hi from California. Ah, I was at the store and saw this and knew I had to get it for Pollux. I watch your YouTube videos and love all of them and your cooking shows now. I love Maxie and Pollux so much. They have a wonderful mother and father. I put the nudge for Maxie, but he has to share them with Pollux. From Barbara. Thank you, Barbara. <laughs> Let's see, what does that mean? Mooey. I think it's what this means. Oh, oh the nudges. Oh, Moo. It's chicken, peas, and carrots. Oh my goodness, Mooey. Do you want to have one of these now? That got you up. Oh, that got Pollux's attention. Moo, oh my goodness, look how big these are. They're soft treats. Oh, Pollux. <gasps> Is that what I see in there? <laughs> Pollux! He working on his tree. He is. What is it, Moose? <laughs> oh. Did that get your attention? <laughs> It's a shrilling chicken. <laughs> <laughs> He's so gentle with it. Oh. <laughs> Barbara, thank you so much for the fan mail. If you're going to send fan mail, if you will put your address inside somewhere on the fan mail, Pollux and Maxie and I will send you a personal thank you note. So Barbara, so sorry, I can't send a note because it was just the address of the mail center. So we say thank you here. Thank you, Barbara. I have a blanket. Maybe. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Go Pollux, go. So these are a huge hit. Chicken <laughs> pot pie nudges. Y'all have had enough guys. He's trying to get his nose in it. Sisters. <laughs> He'll lay there all day and let y'all do that. <laughs> oh, Where are you going with it? Go, Pox. <laughs> so then we decided to get cleaned up and go to the grand opening of a Mexican popsicle stand that opened here in our hometown. So we have friends that own a Mexican restaurant here. It's the best Mexican restaurant in town. That's where we always go. And they opened a popsicle stand. It's all kind of 
Mexican ice cream and popsicles and things that nobody around here has ever seen. But we wanted to go and show our support for our friends. And so we all loaded in the car and went to La Paleta Milindo. The popsicle store is painted in bright colors, hot pink and lime green and sunshine yellow. They had so many cool things and oh my goodness, that place was packed. We went in and looked around. They had chocolate dipped bananas. They had Mexican popsicles, Mexican ice cream, waffle cones, elotes, agua frescas, like all kinds of stuff. So we each picked out something new and unique to us and went outside and enjoyed our Mexican treats. Strawberry ice cream, Ferrero Rocher popsicle. Same thing, boom. Cucumber, lime, and chia. Chia seeds, Rain. aqua fresca, and popsicles. strawberry and kiwi popsicles. Then we came home, it was late afternoon, and we decided to make cocktails. We made pineapple coconut margaritas. Actually, I used two and a half ounces of tequila. And for dinner, I made coconut shrimp. We had roasted Brussels sprouts, baked potatoes, and sweet potatoes, and oh, we just filled our bellies. We sat around, we laughed, we had such a good time. And for the first time ever, all of the kitty cats got to get together and meet each other. So Sasha had never met Mochi, Mochi had never met Milo. So the kitty cats all got to meet each other this weekend. Milo is a boy and he's the oldest. So we kept him in the other room, but Mochi and Sasha got face to face, did a lot of swatting, a lot of sniffing, a lot of hissing, a lot of figuring each other out. But by the time the weekend was over and everybody went home on Monday, they were best friends. Sasha really wanted to play with Mochi. Mochi was not so sure about Sasha in the beginning, but she came around and she decided, I kind of like that girl. So here's the kitty cats getting to meet each other for the first time. Uh, she did it. <laughs> Where are the dogs? Good girl. Oh, Sasha's got Mochi. Pretty girl, Mochi. Mochi. Could be a little nicer. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. You were just she having your moment. <laughs> Mochi. Mochi. Mochi girl. Sasha. Can you come out of our place? Oh, coming out, coming out. Sasha. Oh, show us your best stuff, girl. <laughs> Sassy walk it. Oh, yeah, let's sassy. do a sassy walk. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that was a big leap. Is that a play kiss? Sasha does not know how to read mochi. I think it's more like a calling her to come yeah, play. Yeah, she wants to, she's doing her play thing, like whenever she does her head like that. Then we woke up on Easter morning. Does the Easter Bunny still visit your grown children when they're home visiting you in your house? Well, he came to my house. Somehow or another, he knew that the girls and their boyfriends and the dogs and the cats were all going to be at my house for Easter. So when we woke up on Easter morning, my kitchen was full of Easter baskets. Good morning. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. This is so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh. Did the Easter Bunny come? Yeah, apparently. You knew we were here. Apparently. I'll have to wait for Tebow. These are so cute. And AC thinks they're kitties. Good morning. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Good morning. Hello. Oh. Immediately gets excited. Oh, of course. With Tebow. Of course. 
You said I hadn't seen you all night. Is it Mr. Morning? Are we gonna play? Oh, 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 feisty! Oh, he hopped and skipped. Well, gosh, Moo. Go play. Go play with him. Go play. Oh, he said, okay, okay, I'll come. Oh, go play with him. Oh, no, he's more concerned about that. He went and got it and brought it back to you? Yes, watch this. Oh, Mooey, can I have it? Oh. <gasps> Go get it, Moo! <laughs> oh, my gosh, Mooey! Oh, good job. Oh, good job. That's his dinosaur. Can I have it? Can I have it? <gasps> oh, get it, Moo! <laughs> Bring it back. <laughs> oh, Mooey. That oh, was sweet. Good boy. So sweet, Moose. He loves this. It's his baby dinosaur. Pollock stole it and took his stuffing out. Oh, do you want to play too? Come here, Pollock. No, he wants what's up here. Don't you? <gasps> oh my gosh, look at him go. That is the sweetest thing. He just wants, Pollux wants this. Uh-huh. Moo, that was very sweet, Moo. So, so sweet. Get it, Moo. Bringing you his blanket. Alex, you want to see what the Easter Bunny bought you? You want to see? Come here. You want? You want to give it to him, Kendall? Oh. What is that? Oh. <gasps> is it a bumblebee? Oh. Oh, Pollux. And then this is for Mooey. <gasps> what you got, Moo Moo? You got some treats, buddy? Oh, it's coming back. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Look. Paul, do you want a treat? Uh-oh, dilemma. Uh-oh. He's trying to take it. <laughs> you got to put one of them he down. He took it. <laughs> oh, T-Bone wants to open his. You should go first. I think you should go <laughs> You, yours. Oh, my God. Alex, how's your bumblebee? How your bumblebee, buddy? Alex? Oh, you like a bunny? Tearing up the bumblebee. Oh, <gasps> Alex, you got a bunny rabbit. Oh, Alex. The goal is to tear it up. Pollux, you got to show her what you got from the Easter Bunny. Well, this is mine. <laughs> Technically, that's Blake's basket, oh, the camo. <laughs> oh, just kidding. Oh, the camo, so this one's one. Uh-huh. Oh. Oh, she'll love that. Uh-huh. Yeah. Sparkles. Oh. Yeah. Go oh, show her. You yes. got Bumblebee. That's so cute. <laughs> oh, hey, buddy. Did you get any toys? He's, he got treats. Oh. He got the, strawberry oh, treats. Yeah, show her these. You got strawberry treats. One of the funniest things in the Easter baskets was this. Brecken and Kendall got t-shirts, and here's what they said. What has she got up to her Pollux? Well, how does that make sense? Because <laughs> you're, you you're both my favorite daughters. Oh. Twins. Wait, can you read your shirt? Show your shirt. <laughs> Love it. 
So I had decided to make a huge dinner for Easter dinner. I roasted lemon chickens with croutons. We had mashed potatoes, sweet carrots, and I made homemade cannolis for dessert. We had pistachio and chocolate chip cannolis. And we were all stuffed and just sat around on the couch. Did a lot of nothing after dinner because we were so full. The cats got together, did a lot more playing and roaming the house. Here comes Milo. Oh, hello. You want a toy? Oh. This is a great shot of you, Sasha. Did you see him flip that up? You like your toy? He flipped it up in the air with his paw and then rolled on his back uh. and caught it. Milo, do you love your fish? You love your fish? She's rubbing her face on it. Is that really, oh, really, is. really good stuff? Timo, she's rubbing all over it. Oh, wow, Sasha. Cute you turkey, you know? Oh, the Easter Bunny brought it to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he coming back. Oh. oh. Oh my, oh my gosh, goodness. figure eights in the mud. Eights. Great. Oh boy, squeak him, squeak him. <laughs> there, there's my sweet boys. And then Monday morning, everybody got up and went home, sadly. So I'm here by myself again, just kind of thinking about my wonderful Easter weekend, thinking about how much fun I had having Brecken and Kendall home and their boyfriends here and us just getting together as a family. We often vacation together, have holidays together, get together for birthdays, but we have not been together in this house as a family since Thanksgiving of last year. So I miss my girls so much, but we had such a great weekend and I hope you had a great Easter weekend with your family and your loved ones. And I hope you enjoyed seeing how my Easter weekend went. See you later.